Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. It is not a day or two since ASML wants to realize the free shipment of lithography machines. It has repeatedly persuaded the United States to block shipments, which will lead to interruption of the global supply chain, emphasizing that China is an important participant in the global supply chain. Not selling equipment to China will allow China to accelerate the development of independent lithography machines. But the market rules are not up to ASML. What ASML can do is to increase shipments as conditions permit. ASML currently has a backlog of about 83.9 billion orders from the Chinese market. ASML has announced that it will increase shipments to the Chinese market. From another perspective, ASML is preventing China from developing its own lithography machines. ASML announced its first quarter financial report, achieving net sales of 6.7 billion euros, net profit of 2 billion euros, and net booking sales of 3.8 billion euros. It can be seen from ASML's first quarter financial report report card that ASML's lithography machines are still in short supply and market demand has prompted ASML to have a bright financial report. But ASML wants more than that. Although the performance is good, the chip manufacturing industry in the future is full of variables, and ASML still needs to stabilize the market operation order. On the one hand, major customers such as TSMC and Samsung continue to cut capital expenditures and reduce chip production capacity. On the other hand, the Netherlands reached an agreement with the United States which made ASML's shipment of lithography machines unstable. ASML needs to find a market that has huge demand and can provide ASML with a good business environment, such as China. ASML has been operating in China for decades and has shipped more than a thousand lithography machines, which has been deeply rooted in mainland China. If it weren't for the US to formulate market rules, I am afraid that ASML's shipments of lithography machines to mainland China will be even higher, including the most advanced EUV lithography machines. The rules cannot be changed by ASML. Instead of letting nature take its course, it is better to take the initiative. Therefore, ASML continues to show its favor to the Chinese market, emphasizing that there are still many DUV lithography machines that can be shipped, and after the demand from other customers decreases, more lithography machines can be shipped to China this year. According to ASML, there is currently a backlog of 39 billion euros, about 300 billion yuan, of orders, 30% of which come from mainland China, which is about 83.9 billion yuan. All ASML can ship to China are mature process lithography machines. If ASML completes the delivery of backlog orders, it is conceivable that at least hundreds of lithography machines will land on the production lines of Chinese customers. What effect will this bring? I am afraid that it will bring greater competitive pressure to domestic lithography machines. ASML's aggressive shipments are actually preventing China from developing its own lithography machines. ASML knows that not selling lithography machines to China will lead to China's accelerated self-research. So ASML has greatly increased the production capacity of lithography machines. By 2026, 
The annual production capacity of DUV lithography machines will increase to 600 units, and ASML expects sales in the Chinese market to reach 2.2 billion euros this year. If ASML achieves the expected shipments and sales in the Chinese market, it will increase its market share in China. Lithography machines are not disposable consumables, and their service life is generally about five years. ASML has continuously expanded the size of its Chinese team over the years, providing professional maintenance and after-sales services for Chinese customers, so that the service life of lithography machines can be extended to seven or even ten years. If Chinese customers are using ASML lithography machines in the next 10 years, and domestic lithography machines will make breakthroughs in the future, what kind of competitive advantage can they gain when they enter the market? Or whether there is enough procurement demand? Chinese manufacturers have chosen ASML lithography machines, and the production line has no place for domestic lithography machines. This is not a good thing for the development of domestic lithography machines. Therefore, ASML strives for order opportunities in the Chinese market. In fact, it wants to prevent China from developing its own lithography machines. Take the lead in occupying market share by dumping. Even if domestic lithography machines make breakthroughs in the future, it will be difficult to go on without the support of Chinese customers. However, ASML underestimated the determination of China's self-developed lithography machines. With the United States constantly revising market rules, domestic manufacturers have long since broken their illusions recognized the reality, and actively participated in the development of domestic lithography machines. In order to ensure independent supply demand, China's lithography machine industry should take a series of countermeasures to alleviate the impact, including strengthening independent research and development launching more high-quality domestic lithography machine products, increasing its market share and performance indicators, especially actively developing new lithography machine technology and improving its own core competitiveness. It also strengthens the coordination of the industrial chain, integrates the upstream and downstream resources of the semiconductor manufacturing industry, optimizes the industrial development environment, improves the efficiency and capabilities of semiconductor manufacturing, and promotes the healthy and sustainable development of the entire industrial chain. It is understandable that ASML wants to ship goods. Making money is the primary goal of ASML as a commercial listed company, but the future of Chinese chips cannot be pinned on various variables. ASML has been restricted in shipments, and it is hard to guarantee that it will not face more restrictions in the future. China needs to understand that core technology cannot be bought or exchanged. It must strengthen its own competitiveness, actively take measures to deal with ASML restrictions, further improve the overall level and quality of the industry, and occupy a more favorable position in the global semiconductor manufacturing industry. If you agree with the point of view of this video, please like it, welcome to forward, leave a message and share.